Hello Internet, I'm Matt Haas and this is Awesome Wood Things. Welcome to another episode of WTV, Woodworking Top Videos. Let's do away with this old paper sign and check out the new one I built. Isn't that cool? I may have a video about that coming out, so stick around for that. All right, let's jump right in. Every now and then, a awesome video slips through the cracks and doesn't quite make it into the show. When that happens, we have a segment called, Oops, There It Is. There it is. So let's kick things off. Coming in at number 10 is Dan the Maker Man, his video, Pac-Man Bookends. Check it out. Wasn't that cool? Who doesn't love 8-bit video games? The ghosts were on magnets and he painted the blue version on the opposite side. So creative. And he did it with limited tools. I love when people just get stuff done no matter the tools they have in their workshop. So, so cool. Alright, let's keep it going. Coming in at number 9 is the Hipster Carpenter with Shaker Clock. And this is a particular segment I like to call Up and Comer because this maker has very few subscribers, but should have a lot, lot more. Check it out. Okay, hand cut dovetails. The grain of the wood on the clock face, so, so nice. Check out this guy's back catalog too. He built a cutting board without a surface planer. Use the manual plane. Check him out. Okay, coming in at number eight is Peter Brown's Can You Make a Knife Out of Epoxy? You know what? I need to know the answer to that question. Check out Peter Brown. There it goes. Tore on the second part, but it cut again in the in the front. Can you make a knife out of resin? But yeah, it's clearly a success. And now you know if you can make a knife out of epoxy. I know I feel better having the answer to that question. I hope you do too. Okay, coming in at number seven is MTM Wood Darth Vader End Grain Cutting Board. Check it. <laughs> I love MTM Woods videos. A lot of end grain cutting boards on his channel, but again, Darth Vader, hello, awesome. All right, next up, number six, Adrian Ardale, and his video is how to make a steel minion. Yes, that's right, a minion made of steel. I have to see it. Check it out. And I've cut out a set of crooked teeth to just go in the uh, upper part of his smile. More steel rods for his legs, some nails for his hair, and a bit more uh, sheet metal for his braces. And the minion's finished. I love metalworking videos, and I think the minion turned out great. Okay, up next, number five, David Welder. Picture frame, part one of two. I like how he removed the wood to accept the bent nail. He made something that looked wrong look good. 
And who doesn't love bullets in their artwork? I know I certainly do. Okay, up next with number four, Get Hands Dirty with Grasshopper Pool Toy. Check it out. I've been making these grasshopper toys occasionally and it all started about 16 months ago with a whisper in my ear. I was inspired by the Wood Whispers video and I actually used this template to draw the bodies and legs of my version of this toy. I used to cut the wheels with hole saws in the past, but this time I'm making good use out of my x carb CNC machine. Thanks everyone for watching and I'll catch you later. I think that's a great looking toy and she certainly added her own spin to it. That was Mark Spagnolo's design and Mark even did a video. And that's what I like about it. A maker using other makers material and putting out a similar video. Nothing wrong with that. Kudos. And her videos are always well edited. The time in front of the camera is good. Uh, the, Narration's clear, just a pleasure to watch from beginning to end. Kudos. Okay, coming in at number three is Make It Extreme, Coffee Table to Dining Table. Check this out. Before every Make It Extreme video I watch, I always ask myself, I wonder if this one's going to be extreme also. And you know what? Every time it is extreme. Crazy! I love that channel. Okay, coming in at number two is Kyle Toth making a huge mirror frame. Check it out. Toth. He has several videos with this technique and I tell you, it never gets old. It's absolutely gorgeous. Kudos Kyle. You are a true, true craftsman and a pleasure to watch work. And this is a guy who started out filming on an iPod. Not an iPad, an iPod. Getting it done. I love it. Alright, number one, Cactus Workshop, Industrial Table from Reclaimed Materials. Check it out. single piece was reclaimed, including the rubber feet. Who makes their own rubber feet? Oh yeah, Cactus Workshop does. 
awesome. And I like how he left the printing on the wood for the front drawer. Oh, so, so good. The editing was good. The project was good. Kudos, Cactus Workshop. Love, love, love it. Okay, Internet, that wraps up Episode 2 of Woodworking Top Videos. I really love being part of this community. I love helping makers, and I love the feedback about the show. If you have any suggestions for videos that can be featured, hit me up on social media. Thanks, Internet.